Hello friends! In this video I'll show you all the functions and specifications of the device which is not common multimeter or simple ampere meter this is clamp meter with the possibility of measuring of high current of maximum 400 amps both AC and DC. This device also can measure AC voltage, DC voltage, capacitance, resistance, check diodes and also measure frequency. Moreover, it can show the duty cycle. The device comes in a cardboard box, AC-DC clamp meter, AMO meter, MS2108A, amometer.com. Together with the device we get probes, also very useful things, the bag, and the manual in English. The modes of the device are the following. 400 amps, both DC and AC. By default we have AC and with the help of SELECT we change it to DC. More precise mode, 40 amps, AC and DC. AC voltage, DC voltage, resistance, diode check, continuity test, capacitance test. frequency meter and also if we press the third button percent we get the duty cycle let's go back to the current mode with the help of the first gray button minimum and maximum you can select the corresponding mode so it will measure the current and show you the maximum also you can see minimum value in order to switch off this mode you should use long press the second button rel is relative, but sometimes in case you turn on the device it cannot show you zero in case of absence of the current and you should set the device to zero. So let's check all the functions except current measurement and regarding the current let's compare this device to the common multimeter. According to the manual in case of absence of the voltage Anyway, you can see some low voltage on the display, but it's absolutely normal and it will not affect the measurement as soon as you start measuring. So the voltage is OK. DC 4.14. It's OK. Mega ohm. 5600 according to the inscription 220 microfarads this is first and this is a second two three one so not bad as to the frequency So you can check the mains frequency directly, without any resistor or something else. Duty 50%. Now let's check the clamps and compare this device to the common multimeter. Please pay your attention to the arrows on the clamps. 
so it's highly recommended to place other wire in this position. Here we have a car bulb. Let's turn on the device. AC, DC, and rail. Also, in case of need, we can turn on the backlight. Long press BL. We have here the backlight, and also here we have light emitting diode. Let's turn on the power supply. So we can see 4.5, 4.4. The result is not bad. In fact, this car bulb has two lamps inside. Let's change the lamp. Five point one, five point one. So the third digit is not so important, but anyway, we see a really excellent result. In this case, the measurement will be not so precise. But anyway, let's check. DC and relative. 5.0, 5.0. Excellent. Let's check with both lamps. We will check in the second mode. 8.4, 8.4. So I'm very impressed with the result. As to the device itself, it has pretty decent design, strong clamps, this part is rubberized, and as to the power supply, there is no need of 9 volt battery. The device operates on 3 batteries of 3A size. The weight of the device including batteries is not more than 260 grams. That's all for this review. If you have questions, please write them in comment section. Thanks for watching. Wish you good luck.